Welcome to Shaftman TV. Thanks a lot for joining me today. It looks like Jesse Lingard's Man United future is in serious doubt after talks over a new contract collapsed. A 28 year old's deal expires this summer and United are hoping to extend his time at Old Trafford after an excellent loan spell with West Ham in the second half of last season. Lingard opted to stay at United this season, even though six or seven clubs asked about his services because he believed Ole Gunnar Solskjaer would provide him with more game time. Instead, he's only actually started one season, or one game all season, excuse me, the EFL Cup defeat by West Ham in September. He's also made seven sub appearances, totaling only 76 minutes. It means he has had more playing time with England this campaign than with Man United, even though he lost his place in the England squad for the qualifiers against Albania and San Marino. Lingard allegedly reportedly is one of a number of players left confused by Solskjaer's decision not to give him more chances and as the club looked to arrest their terrible run of results which obviously included a 5-0 defeat to Liverpool and a 2-0 defeat to Man City. United obviously play Watford on Saturday, Villarreal on Tuesday and then Chelsea on the 28th of November. It's understood that under the circumstances, Lingard, who's been at United since he was seven, sees little point in seeking further talks and will hope to secure a lone move away in January. For me, he can go. Before his lone move to West Ham, he was abysmal for about 18 months, two years. And I think people forget that because of his, his, you know, his brilliant loan move to West Ham. Uh, personally, he's a very useful player in certain tactical scenarios. But if he wants to go, and if Pogba wants to go, United should clear the decks, clear the wage bill, and <clears throat> bring players in who are going to fight for the place and fight for the shirt. That's my view. What do you think? Do you think he's been mistreated by Oli Gunnar? And I think, uh, you know, uh, there is a certain narrative about him, Sancho, Van der Beek being underplayed by Solskjaer, but United have got a massive squad and there's only 11 places available and they've got probably like 25, 27, 30 players and 30 doesn't go into 11. So what do you think? Give me your views below. Thanks for joining me.